How are you? I'm great, thank you. Nice to see you. Nice to be seen. It is. <laughs> what is your name? My name is Adeline Bates. I'm from Arizona. What is your job in Arizona? For a number of years, I was a vocal coach, and now I'm a writer. So let me ask you something. Why now are you coming back to singing? What was going on? Um, when I was a teenager, I was in a group with my sister and a couple of other young ladies. And after that group broke up, I, I never had the confidence to be on stage by myself. And then I had children, and they had to come first. Wow, priority. I love that. So now it's about you. So now I'm on the front burner, and it's about me. Well, break a leg. <laughs> no. Howie. That is unbelievable. I actually have to go and get ready. Oh. So I shall return. Thank you. I didn't see. I didn't know. I didn't, I didn't see. You literally you, Yes, you, you did. did it. Yes, you, you did. did. <laughs> you know you did. <laughs> so, what's going on now? Hello, it's taking a while. Come on. I love being surprised. And Julianne said, is it, am I supposed to laugh or is it good? And I said, it's both. Yeah. It's funny but yes, good. <laughs> this is so fun and entertaining. And what we're looking for in this day and age is to, to feel good. And that's what it's meant to do. You're rad. Yeah, we all. At 63, she came out here on this stage and did not one but two performances. Yeah, yeah. I love that this is what your me time looks like. Oh, way to go. This was so unexpected and such a surprise, and you do have great range. You're unique, so thank you. Thank you. You are adorable. The most amazing energy. As much as you had a good time, we had a good time. Yeah. And that's what it's all about. I want to say to both of you, it's a yes. Julianne. Thank you. Thank you. You are unforgettable. That's a yes. Thank you. That's three yeses. Oh, thank you. And you know what? I hope you two stay together for years and years to come. It's a fourth yes. We will. It's hilarious. It is. So much fun. I can't wait to see who you're going to be next time.
What's your name and where are you from? My name is Scott Hireman and I'm from... Oh my gosh, I don't even know them. Uh, my name is Scott Hireman and I'm from Lexington, Kentucky. What are you going to be doing for us today? I'm going to be doing comedy. Do you always dress up when you do your comedy? Um, usually I just dress up if I'm like at home cooking or cleaning, but... Are you making a living with comedy? No, I'm a pizza delivery boy. <laughs> <laughs> and anyway. when you deliver pizza, do you do you dress like this? No, you do, I'm no. delivering pizza in like 12 inches of snow in Kentucky, but I, keep, I have the pink eyebrow always, so I deliver pizza with a little bit of something, but not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Are you single? Because Nick's newly single. I think we should go on a date. Look at his shoes, they're sparkly as mine, look. <laughs> well, I already like you. Um, you know what? Go for it, I can't wait. Okay, well, hello, everybody. So a little bit about me, I'm adopted, which basically means my original family said no thank you. <laughs> my sister's actually adopted too. Uh, my mom can't have kids because she's emotionally unavailable for committed relationships. <laughs> my sister growing up was the golden child. Like when she graduated high school, my parents threw her a huge party and I got nothing when I dropped out. They're always like, Scott, why can't you be more like your sister? I'm like, how's this? <laughs> Funny. <laughs> They're like, oh my funny. gosh, that's horrifying. But actually, I haven't always looked like this. True story starring me, I used to be 300 pounds. No. Can you believe it? Yes, Mel B, yes! Heidi, can you believe I it? I don't believe you. I miss being fat. You know, I miss being able to wear a t-shirt and sweatpants to formal events and people being totally fine with that, you know? <laughs> and okay, you know who I was really jealous of growing up? Besides skinny people and kids whose parents kept them. <laughs> the oh my gosh. Someone applauding, yay, I was rejected too. The Girl Scouts. I was in the Boy Scouts, my mom signed me up for Boy Scouts. But while the Girl Scouts were sipping soda over at the Holiday Inn Express watching the Little Mermaid for their Marine Time Under the Sea Fun Time badge, I was in the middle of Bucktooth, Kentucky trying to survive off testosterone and trail mix. <laughs> Talking about, all right boys, we brought you out here to teach you survival skills. <laughs> Oh, really? Why don't you teach me how to do my taxes? Why don't you teach me how to deal with the breakup tax? <laughs> LOL. <laughs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> oh. Look at that. This is me. How are you? Thank you. <laughs> Good job. Oh. Listen, well, I am so nervous right now. I have been well, in these spanks for like eight hours, so tell me, Melby, tell I me. I don't think there's any, there's no reason for you to be nervous. I thoroughly enjoyed that. And keep being fabulous, that's all I can Thank say. Thank you. I'd love to go see him in a club or... or I would. I would uh, you're great. Is that a date, Howie? <laughs> <laughs> Stop flirting with me, I'm married. <laughs> I thought that you were so funny and so fabulous. You better work. It's the first time that I truly love, love, love a comedian on this stage, and that is wow. you. Wow, that's big from Heidi. Hit it. Hit it. <laughs> now she's oil on the wall. She's a kind of like a dog. Take to feel it. What? Seriously. <laughs> oh, no, she's not. She's not. No, no, she's not. Talking right now. She's a lady. She's such a pretty lady right now. Oh, my God. I can't believe she's a lady. Lady. Oh, my God. She's a lady. That is a show.
entertaining you're such a good performer you're funny you're different you're confusing you know i think you got a possibility of going really far in this contest you are amazing i loved it thank you julia i mean i can absolutely see you in vegas right now owning a show i would come every weekend thank you so much simon I have to tell you, I was like, what the bloody hell is that? But this was fantastic. It is exactly why we created this show, to find people like you. This was a great audition. Good for you. Thank you, Simon. Jen, I, I'm here for the whole thing. I love a faux ending, and you gave us three. You should get used to this kind of reaction. Thank you. Let's take it to a vote. Howie. Yes. Yes. Oh, you got two yeses. Yes. Julianne. This is easy. You got three. Yes. No, Simon. Oh, sorry, baby. And now you have four. to you right oh. now? It means that I get to show my stuff to the rest of the world, you know? I come from Australia, I'm coming from a small little suburb, and here I am in the biggest stage in the world. Like, come on. It's amazing. I loved it, and I love what you said. Like, it's comedic, and it's she's a good singer, and it's funny. It's a show. 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 It's